Hi there. Um, it's late night with Mia, and I'm just kind of like getting ready to go to bed. But I watched a video from Dorian Writer, <laughs> um, and it talked about fat, sick, and nearly dead, and what he thought of the Juice Fest. And I just wanted to make a video in response to that because uh, I'm somebody who uh, was really, really sick and uh, was due to a long history of, you know, extreme stress and uh, a lot of bad food. <laughs> and uh, I did um, some juice fasts after I watched the movie Fat, Sick, and Early Dead. I decided to try that because, um, frankly, I thought I was going to die. I was... I was pretty much willing to do whatever it took and at the time it just it sounded like a good idea so I did um, a 30-day juice fast and before I did that I weighed 245 pounds and I was 5'10 so I um, was obese right before my juice fast I started to have seizures and they weren't super bad seizures but you know, they were like this, um, and they were bad enough that it was really uncomfortable. Uh, I'd been sick for several years. Anyways, it's a very long story. I had a lot of symptoms that were really similar to multiple sclerosis, um, a lot of cognizance problems, um, s speech problems. I couldn't say a fluent sentence. I would stop and become confused and a lot of times when people talk to me, I kind of heard just, you know, gibberish. So I had a really hard time for a long time. It felt like I was hung over every day, even though I didn't drink a drop. Um, I had trouble walking. I would miss steps, and my legs would give out on me. Um, I was using a walker and canes to walk a lot of the time. Anyways, a lot of really bizarre problems, and... Um, they would come and go. I'd have remissions and flare-ups. And um, I was kind of going into a flare-up again before I did the juice fast. And um, I did the first 30-day one. And let me tell you, I felt results immediately. And uh, it's not just about weight loss. It's also about giving the digestive system a break because the digestive system takes so much um, energy and the body's resources to digest things. It's said that if you're taking just juice and not food, that the fasting period gives your body a greater ability to heal. And then with the um, sudden flood of uh, nutrients, you know, the concentrated flow of nutrients and live enzymes, compared to the <clears throat> standard American diet that your body might be used to, it's really a big change and so your body heals pretty rapidly. As I experienced in my case, I healed really quickly. Now I'm not saying I couldn't have done this with a raw food diet or the 80-10-10 diet, I, um, which isn't a diet at all, I understand it's a lifestyle. Um, and I could have done that, but I don't want to discount the power of juicing at the same time because it helped me so immensely. In fact, after the, 30, the first 30-day juice fast, um, in which I lost 30 pounds, incidentally, I did another 30-day juice fast, and then I did a 10-day juice fast, and then another 30-day juice fast. Right now, I am on, after a year and a half, I am on my fourth juice fast, and I'm actually on day 87 and I feel terrific. I feel great. I have energy. I feel alert, alive, awake. And uh, I swear to God, even my consciousness is getting better and I'm having evolution of uh, just who I am and everything. So much has happened. And another thing I want to say is that um, I have become vegan through this whole thing. After my first juice fast, the whole 30 days, I uh, researched and watched uh, nutrition documentaries and food documentaries and you know searched the internet for uh, nutritional knowledge and I think if you're a smart person 
and you really go for it and try to educate yourself about nutrition, I think you're going to come to um, the deduction that <laughs> vegan is really the way to go. You know, you don't need animal products to survive. And, you know, Durian Rider's totally right. I, I love his videos. I love his attitude. I love the way he's harsh sometimes, but it's, you know, he's so to the point. And I agree with everything, really, that he says. Um, but I really don't agree that juice fasting is not a beneficial thing. It's, again, it's not only for weight loss. It's for um, healing of your body as well. And discovery. It's discovery about how great fruits and vegetables are. And it, it customs your taste buds to just that for a while, which in turn makes you crave that when you get off of it and can turn you vegan. It did me. And <clears throat> now... I'm actually even evolving to where when I get off this juice fast, I'm going to be on the 80-10-10, which is going to be really exciting and awesome uh, to be on raw food. And, and Durian Rider is one of the people who has inspired me, along with Freelia. So, you know, as far as gaining all the weight back, I have to say that that is true. If you do not change your lifestyle and you do not change your habits, you don't evolve to a better way of eating, you are going to gain that weight right back. I mean... That just, that's a no-brainer, but uh, I think, at least I recommend when I talk to people about it, try to educate them and help them through it, I let them know that it's very important to educate yourself and uh, evolve into a better diet and nutrition lifestyle. So, you know, and, and really what I'm aiming for is go vegan. <laughs> but I try to be, you know, I try to kind of, uh, work that in slowly and gradually. I don't want to like shock people and go, hi, you need to do a juice fast, go vegan, because they're just going to get shocked and say, no, <laughs> I like my bacon. I like my ice cream. I like my cheese. I can't live without my cheese, <sniffs> whatever. But um, yeah, I do try to uh, get people to go in that direction. I think it's very important. Um, I think fasting is like a gateway drug. You know, it can... It can be that N that can help people decide that they want to be vegan. That's what I really think. So um, I think it's a good idea to like look at juice fasting and kind of don't just skim the surface. Really look into it and look at some of the people that have done it and what they say and how it's changed their lives. And, you know, I'm one that's, that's experienced it and it's really done a lot for me. It's changed me from being like a fat, bloated person that um, was very sickly and uh, had a food addiction. I mean, I was really like hardcore into food addiction and it really brought me out of that. So it did a lot of things for me. And um, if you're watching Durian Ritter, Harley, <laughs> you're awesome. I, I love you and I love your videos and I love uh, the work that you're doing and helping people so much and changing you know, people's minds and educating them. So keep on doing what you're doing. Um, I just, I just wanted to say some things about juice, fi juice fasting for, in its defense, because God, you know, it's done so much for me, which I could have done just going raw, you know, it would have taken longer, but you know, really right now what I'm doing it for is health. And I'm seeing if I can go just a little bit further with it and see if it will help my body any better than just eating raw by itself. Um, because it did so much for me already, I'm thinking if I do it longer this time, that it will help me even more. I am absolutely desperate. This uh, whatever illness that I have is just a real kick in the ass. So doing the best I can to try to get through it and get rid of it. So all of you out there, um, stay strong and be open-minded, be understanding, and look at all angles and really investigate things. See you guys later. Have a great one.